Ciao. So how so how's life been after New York Fashion Week? <laughs> it's been great. It's been great. I'm so glad I did it because the amount of connections that I've made are just phenomenal even like like connections with you connections with photographers in new york around the world other publications just like kind of building up my rolodex of people who i can like always call upon for like business connects and business collaborations and opportunities has been so invaluable and but more so is that i actually decided to go back to school to get my um diploma in fashion design so you guys would call it like community college we call it college here like you know the two-year oh, yeah. college yes yeah. so i did that and mm -hmm. i finished and then now i'm in university getting my uh, bachelor's of design in fashion okay and yeah and the reason why i want to do that is because i'm already like the artist designer that's all good and great you know you're kind of born with these things god gives us right. these gifts but I know that I want to be the best designer that I could be. And mm -hmm. going to school doesn't make you a designer, but it definitely, just like you were just saying, hones in your skills. I'm here in university to be the best pattern maker, to be the best illustrator, to be the best mm -hmm. sewer, to be the best designer so that I can make the best garments that I can possibly make. Let me tell y'all something. The pattern pattern makers, y'all, y'all can get all the applause. That is too much work <laughs> and too much magic for my black ass. Okay. I only do yeah, I buy little simple little patterns off of Etsy. I know how to sew and stuff, but yeah, doing drafting and doing yeah. your own and I don't know <laughs> where are you? How much do you want? I wanted to stop right here and yeah yeah pattern making is too much yeah. for me yeah and that's the thing like the pattern drafting there's really a lot less artistic stuff to it it's all it's like all technical mm -hmm. these are all technical skills that you really have someone has to teach you they have to show you and and so that's one thing that i really want to hone i don't just want to be listen a lot of people call themselves designers but they're really illustrators they're 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 really good at the illustrating they're really good at the drawing right. they're really good at the painting but when it comes to actually making the garment making your pattern cutting sewing finishing putting your buttons on like making something gorgeous making something wearable making something comfortable can you bend in it can you sit in it how are you going to go in the wash yes and all of these yes. little things you know what i'm trying to say these are technical mm -hmm. skills that school teaches you so yeah school is important kids <laughs> but yeah it's too much math for me i'm like <laughs> no girl take it i don't want it call me when you're done and we will do the test but yeah, yeah. no pattern makers y'all can y'all can have that job fair enough <laughs>